Are you consistently inconsistent when it comes to coaching in the moment? Why don't you give us a few moments of your time and we'll give you some quick tips to help you harness the power of this information flow tool. Welcome to another episode of Do Business Better, where we give salon, spa, and med spa owners like you quick tips to help you make more money, inspire your team, and create the ultimate client experience. So are you consistently inconsistent when it comes to utilizing the power of the coaching in the moment tool? Coaching in the moment is exactly what it sounds like. You talk to somebody in the moment. This doesn't always have to be a tool for correction. You can also use this tool to give kudos when you see somebody doing something well, kind of a caught you doing something right coaching in the moment. But if you're stuck and find yourself maybe ignoring the little things that need to be adjusted in your company because you don't know how to utilize coaching in the moment, why don't you try these three easy steps? Number one, you want to make sure that you do exactly what the title implies, coach in the moment. Now, we understand that sometimes you can't say something right then. You certainly don't want to correct in front of a guest or even in front of another team member. So from time to time, we can't exactly coach right in that moment. But why don't you try developing a code word or a code phrase with your team and letting them know that you have something that you need to speak about soon. As long as you get to it within 24 hours, you are still coaching in the moment. You're making that course correction as soon as you possibly can. Number two, pay attention to your approach. A lot of people don't like to coach in the moment because it feels a little confrontational. Yes, coaching in the moment is a lot of times used as a tool for correction, but it doesn't have to be confrontational. Just because you're suggesting another way for someone to do something doesn't mean that you have to come at them with anger or with a wall put up. It can be a very casual conversation, and I suggest you start it with asking for permission. May I coach you on that? And number three, don't forget to utilize coaching in the moment for the good stuff too. It's a lot more fun when you're using coaching in the moment for a caught you doing something right episode. So make sure that you find your happiness in coaching in the moment, monitor your approach and get the information to your team immediately. That's what coaching in the moment is for, to make a course correction right when a course correction is needed. If you like what you saw here today, please be sure to hit like and follow. If you're watching us on YouTube, go ahead and hit subscribe and make sure to click that little bell icon at the bottom of your screen so that you'll get notifications on future videos. And if you saw something today that you thought someone might benefit from, go ahead and share it with them. I know they would appreciate it, as would we.